morning, everyone, and happy Sabbath. I hope you are having a blessed day thus far. Today, I want to introduce you a story about origami. Origami is a Japanese tradition of folding pretty paper and making figurines. Now, when you fold a paper, you have to crease it. And so, I'm going to fold this for you. I'm going to make a crease in this paper. Now, when you make a crease, the paper is no longer flawless, but has a folded line in it. See? Now it has a folded line. Oh, it's not pretty anymore. But, that's okay. Because the more you fold it, the more you have a figurine of your choosing. It's interesting because God allows things to happen in our lives, allows things to put creases in our lives. And we ask God, why? Why are you folding us this way? Why are you allowing these things to happen? And God says, well, you know, it's not that I want these things to happen to you, but it's for your betterment. It's to help you be a better person and to help you become stronger in Christ. And it's interesting because by the time all the creases in your life are folded and ready to go, your life has become better. And all of a sudden, you have this pretty little figurine. And what I have made for you today, if I can get it open, <laughs> is a cup. I learned to make this when I was in fourth grade. So here is a cute little cup that is made out of of origami. And I guess the point I'm trying to make to you today is that even though life has trials and tribulations and you ask God, why are you allowing this to happen? I'm a good person. I'm a good Christian. I don't deserve this. God says, I have a plan for you. <laughs> and my plan is that you will grow from this. And that you will learn that I love you so dearly. And that even though you have all of these creases and these lines in you that left marks, it's to show you that you can become better from it. And that it's a reminder that I will always take care of you no matter what. So I pray to God for you today that despite all the troubles and tribulations you face in life that you realize that the end result is beautiful because God is the ultimate art artist and he will never leave a lump of clay a lump of clay he will always form it into something beautiful so I hope and pray to God today that you remember that he loves you so much and that despite what you're going through, it will become a beautiful product in the end. Happy Sabbath.